So I, I missed yesterday. I'm sure you guys were distraught. But uh, this will be technically day six, but I'll say it's day five. I'll just talk about day five because I missed one. Uh, yeah, things are going pretty well. I'm in a, I go here sometimes. This is a, there's a, where dead people stay. I'm not weird or nothing. I'm not like a goth guy. Like, but uh, it's quiet here. No one ever comes in here. And I think all these people were important, but I'm more important than them now because they're dead. So it don't matter. A lot of their graves are all fucked up too, but they mow the grass, but they don't pick the graves up, which I think is weird. But uh, yeah, so let's a little quiet place here. Uh, shows have been going really well. Uh, kid shows coming together. A nice lady named Faye has been uh, jumping in there. She does like a little orchestra with vegetables and stuff. And uh, she really, I don't like that she's way better than me at that because I work on that. But she came in, not the vegetable thing, but doing the kid show. And she just rolls right in. She's like, oh, it's my first time, and then just nails it. So fuck her. Uh, but no, I'm glad she's there. Um, my hat looks huge in this camera. Look at that. It's like a giant duckbill hat. But uh, anyway, I'll put it to the side like a rapper. I'll go tell you a little funny story. I was flying. I fly on this busy street for my show, Cowgate. And there's a bunch of other flyers there. So we're all like a bunch of squirrels trying to get the same nut, right? But... I was talking to this one lady, she's normally pretty nice, but uh, she flyers for like a poetry comedy lady, and uh, this isn't important, well it is important actually, she's uh, like the, she's a bit of like the, like I'm, I'm a lesbian, like the, like the real manly lesbian types, which I don't have any issue with, but she was joking around, she's like, that's my lady right there, I was like, oh, your girlfriend? She's like, no, that's who I'm flying for, she's like, my girlfriend's at home, and I was like, well, that's where she belongs, right? Uh, just a joke. I thought it was a joke. She's like, I don't like misogyny. I'm not into that. And I think, and I run a website called the Z List Comedians. That means misogynistic comedians. And now I'm duty bound to report you. And I was like, one, well, that was a, she's American too, so they say a thing about irony. And she's a big, angry lesbian. But that's not important either. But uh, what I'm saying, I told her, I was like, well, I think I was just joking. Like it was a joke, as in you guys are both women. She's like, what's that supposed to mean? I was like, I think it means you both have a vagina. Like, that's what I mean. I didn't mean any kind of harm by it. And I was like, and she's like, well, okay, I won't report you. And I was like, well, thanks for, you're so kind. I was like, uh, but let me, I think you're not fitting the stereotypes. A lot of people say butch lesbians, like, you don't have a sense of humor. But I'm glad to see that you clearly do. And then I told her, I was like, I know you didn't get the other joke. So that was a joke, too. I actually think you're a dick. But uh, so now she's going to put me on her website, the Z-List. I never heard of it before, but I told her, guess who does a video blog every day, and I'm going to blow you up on it. And millions of people are going to see you, random lesbian lady. Uh, but hopefully, it, now it's weird there by our little spot where we fly her, but hopefully we can make nice before the end. Maybe she'll be my friend maybe later. But uh, anyway, that's my thing is um, the shows are going well. Shows are going all right. I don't know. For some reason, I'm just attracted like 20-year-old stoner dudes. Last year was all gray hair. This year, it's dudes with like the big hole in their ear, which is distracting for me. Like I just want to like hook my keys to it or something where I'll padlock them in and then they can't go. I'll just ear them all together. And they put a lot of pennies in my thing. That's good. But they got to spend their money on the weed. So, anyway, uh, I'm enjoying myself, having a lot of fun, uh, making friends, except for the one lady who's a little bit mad, and uh, other than that, oh, also I did Ben Fogg and Hannah Berry George's gig, um, it was really nice, they do like a talk show thing, and I will tell you, it's on St. Mary Street, and it's got the nicest bathrooms of any Edinburgh venue, it's nice, it's like a house, they got like a throw rug in there, it's huge, you can really spread your legs, like my, like you can just really get in there and do what you gotta do, if you got a number two, uh, go to that venue because that's the place to be. Anyway, uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow or maybe later today. I don't know.